Hey guys, my name's Jamie and today I'm going to show you a little bit about my new custom firmware for the Droid X360. Uh, it's called Next360. It's based on AOSP with a few tweaks, uh, most notably performance tweaks as well as Clockwork Mod for backups and recoveries and compatibility with LockNet's game keyboard. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about both of those later on, but for now let's show you how to install the thing. First of all, you're going to need a couple of files. You can get them both from the link in the description. You're going to need the Next360 image uh, as well as the LiveSuit Flash Tool program. Let's go ahead and install LiveSuit. I've just unzipped it to its own folder here. And double click on the EXE. We'll install the program. You'll probably get asked to install some unsigned drivers. Go ahead and do that. And then press LiveSuit EXE. We can go ahead and close the user wizard and use this little package looking button to select our Next360 firmware. Now comes the tricky part. We need to get our Droid X360 into recovery mode. Uh, this takes about six different hands, but I'm gonna try and do it with two, and I'll show you how I go about it. First of all, as a quick overview, what you need to do, uh, make sure that your Droid X360 is currently powered off. Uh, you'll also wanna remove any micro SD cards from the top of the device, um, so what we're going to do is we're going to press and hold the little R and U button on top of the device. While doing so, plug in the USB cable and then press and hold the power button, all while continuing to hold the R and U button. Sounds a little tricky. I'll show you how I do it. I'm just using an ordinary uh, sewing needle to press the R and U button. You can use a pen or a thumbtack or whatever you have available. So let's just go ahead and press that in. Then we want to insert the USB cable and then immediately press and hold the power button until LiveSuit detects that there's a device plugged in. There we are, easy. Okay, so we wanna press yes, and then yes, and LiveSuit will now flash our Droid X360. Okay, so LiveSuit has finished flashing our Droid X360, and as you can see, it's kindly rebooting it for us. Uh, first boot's gonna take a minute or two, guys, so don't stress out, and there's also gonna be this large period with a black screen here. Uh, again, don't panic, it's not bricked. Uh, I had a few dramas displaying the init logo, so I've removed it for this version. Uh, but after about 10, 20 seconds, you should see the next 360 boot sequence. Um, things will be a little laggy as it starts up for the first time, just as it goes through its pre-install routines, installs a few APKs. Uh, however, once you're through to the desktop, you should be fine. As always, any dramas, jump on the forums and let me know. Uh, look out for the next video. We're going to talk about rec uh, Clockwork Recovery Mod. Cheers.